This is Michael Horn back with CareStream Health, introducing the latest release of View Motion, the zero footprint browser neutral viewer for referring physicians and clinicians. Although we can incorporate this viewer into an existing EMR or HIS, you can also give users access to View Motion outside of those other information systems. So when I log in, I can search for a specific patient by name, ID, or session. I can filter by any number of criteria, including date, patient location, status, modality, etc. Or in this case, I'm just going to sort by patients that already have a report. When I generate a work list of my patients or patients from my group, I see basic patient information such as ID, date of birth, gender. If I have a critical results indicated in our PAC system, I also have the indicator as an exclamation mark so I know there's a message from the, re from the radiologist. In addition to the study information, I can see if there's a report, a note, and or key images. If I just want to review the report, I simply click the piece of paper and up comes the report. Keep in mind our latest version of PACS also includes advanced lesion management tools which can document all of the recess criteria we can then insert into the diagnostic report along with key images. To view the actual studies, I simply select the patient name and up comes the current image along with a very basic tool set. Included in this tool set is zoom, pan, window level, or I can use your presets that have been built into the system. I can do line measurements. I can also come in and delete those measurements. Notice my DICOM headers at the top of each corner of the screen. I can also anonymize the study by hiding those. I can flip the image, reset it, or play cine mode. To the right of my screen, I can pop out a panel that displays a text version of the report, along with any notes from the radiologist, which may include critical values. At the bottom left portion of the screen, I can actually see any additional series or key images that have been included with the study and split my screen. So if I want to display my localizer with scalp marks, I can view it that way. Or if I choose to, over on the left side of the screen, I have a panel with prior exams. So I may choose to, instead of the localizer, put a prior side by side. Now if I line up these slices, I can also come back to the series selector and link these studies together so that they scroll, sc scroll through simultaneously. And if I've been given permission, I can save this image and report, email it to a colleague, or print it out. If I'm on a Windows PC, I could also launch my full CareStream view packs for more advanced tool sets. The images are displayed in a JPEG 2000 format lossy compression, which shows me right here. If I want full resolution, I can de decompress this image, and the lossy indicator shows that I've decompressed and now have full resolution in JPEG 2000 format.